there is Carter. Now the starting group for the visitors. Carter out there with Hayes. And it's Gilbert in at the two. Hayes up top. Passes it to Gilbert. Six on the shot clock. Shoots the three. Sinks the three-pointer. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Here's Wright. Now the pass to Wheeler. First free throw is good. He's off on the second. Pass to Wright. From deep, Bagley trying to free himself up. Carter with it. Pass to Hayes. Knocked loose. Here's Clemens. Bagley with the rebound. Here's Wheeler. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Wheeler. Puts the two and a half minutes in. The first one falls. And so he hits both. First quarter of basketball, just over two and a half minutes play. And here's Carter. Baseline jumper. And it's wide right. Hits off the rim. And here in the first, uh, about three minutes in. Wide side Bagley. One up, one down. Two points with his first shot this game. Able to make him pay. Wheeler the pass to Bagley. Right outside. Outside Bryant. Lock at six. And there's the pass to Wheeler. Bagley trying to free himself up. No basket with that shot. Having trouble finding his range. He's one for five. to the paint. Pass to Gilbert. And that won't go. Missing the go-ahead bucket. And still a close game as the first quarter comes to a close. The home team, they're up by one. And don't go away. We'll be back momentarily. And here in the second, two minutes gone by. The pass to Spellman. Shot clock at five. There's three pointers off the mark. Here's Connaughton. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. A step back shot here. Good. And the D just a step slow, reacting to the step back. Clemens guarded by Bradley. Up top, Portis. Pass to Clemens. Let's the three fly. And it's Bradley with the rebound. And they're running. Fires the three. Nila Kina can't hit. 156 left in the first half of the game. Charge passes to Clemens. Back to Charge. Fade away. 
Yep, it counts. A, a, a tough start scoring the basketball, but they're starting to turn it around now. Yeah, it looks like they've gained a little bit of confidence as the lid has come off the hoop. Here's Neil Aquino. Outside Bradley. 125 left now here in the second. No good that time. Well, you will not see that from him very often, especially right at the rim. Gilbert and the powerful one-handed slam. And obviously a total team player. Sharic is a guy, if his teammate is open, he's going to get the ball. Every time I have a chance to review the line. There's the pass to Gilbert. Over right. And he was able to put it up in time, but doesn't fall. And the first half comes to a close in a tie game. Stay with us, folks. We'll get back just after halftime to start the third quarter. Why? Kenny? Well, I think they're feeling the energy of this hometown crowd. Sometimes you get a little complacent and comfortable in your surroundings, but no, they fed off adrenaline in the first half. And Shaq, let's get your input on the visiting team. I think they let the game come to them. But they haven't got to the foul line enough, Ernie. That's an area where they're getting beat. i like to see them press to action a little bit more. Here in the third, Valentine passes to Wheeler. Shot clock at six. For the lead. Here's Bryant. And finish off by Bryant. It's good to see a player going all out when the game's this tight. Well, for sure. Gilbert guarded by Wright. Here's Gilbert. That's the sixth make from the field. He's taken nine shots and missed but three. And if you're the guy who has to guard him, it is never going to be an easy night for you. Right, the pass to Wheeler. 13 feet away. Good on the jump shot. Seven points in the game. The, the mid-range jumper is a high percentage shot for him, and when he's got that much room, forget about it. Gilbert, guarded by Wright. Wright with the double team. Hayes, the pass to Clemens. Fires the jumper from the corner and nails it. Clemens. The pass to Bagley. To the middle. Here's Gortat. Whoops, there's the 24-second shot clock violation, so they'll turn it over. You know, guys, sometimes that just happens, but don't... Charge outside. Pass to Portis. And it's all evened up. And so far in the second half, this has been a different kind of game than what we saw early on. No question about it. I mean, these teams are really battling hard now. To the inside. Knocks it loose. And stolen by Portis. From deep three-point range. Off on that one. And we wrap up the third and looking to be an exciting fourth quarter. And we'll have the start of the fourth quarter for you as soon as we get back from this short break. This is what we play for, fellas. Let's knock them on their heels right out of the timeout. Show them how much you want it. Go get it. He really is fired up about this game, Kevin. And it's out of bounds. Out of bounds. Uh, they say it was last touched by Bagley into the fourth quarter in this one. Foul call. Carter against Bagley. And Wright kicks to Valentine. Clock at six. Back to Wright. Just his first attempt. Carter pulls it in. Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. They could use a bucket. Second chance shot. Shooting foul as the whistle blows. He'll shoot two free throws. He's perfect from the line this time. 
he is absolutely the guy you want at the line in that situation. It just shows you how much he loves these moments. Now here's Wright. Here's Wheeler. And he drops it in from the low post. Now how about how he sets his man up there, runs him right into the screen, and then gets the basket. Wright. Gilbert guarded by Wright. Up again. Bagley with the rebound. Bagley's got rebound number five here tonight. Here's Wheeler. And it's off the back rim. No good. You, you almost have to assume he's going to knock those down when he is that open. Clemens guarded by Wright. Here's Clemens. Off target at the rim. And he did everything he could to make that shot as difficult as possible. And you know what, guys? That will pump him up because he takes a ton of pride in what he does on defense. Plays it up and banks it in. We've got 123 left in the fourth. He couldn't stay in bounds, and that's going to be a turnover. Gilbert guarded by Wright to the middle. Oh, wow, a huge basket to tie the game. And you want him taking big shots for you in big moments. That one was as easy as it gets. Well, you don't want to give him any open shots at this stage. Never mind a layup. Come on now. My goodness. Wow, what a rough second half for him shooting the basketball. Maybe you adopt a, a pass-first mentality at this point. Oh, you just... There's 47 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Here's Wheeler. It's rebounded by Hayes. And, and he has definitely been struggling in this quarter. You know, guys, it seems to me as though he's over anxious. He seems to be pressing, trying too hard, moving too fast. Just needs to calm himself down and wait for good shots. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game clock. Five on the clock. Trying his luck from deep. Can't get the three to fall. I'm deep. Oh, it's no good. And we're headed to overtime. And regulation now complete. We will go to overtime. And we'll return shortly. All fueled up and ready to go to overtime basketball here. Brought to us by Gatorade. Let's check out who's on the floor. We've got Bobby Portis. And it's Clemens in at the point guard position. With the teardrop, Bagley with the rebound. Bagley's got his sixth rebound on the night. Wheeler, the pass to Bagley. Makes it off the glass. And I tell you what, when Bagley plays with energy, it is difficult trying to stop him. Awesome at just staying on the attack. the pass to Clemens. Oh, and there's the alley-oop. You know, passes like that go a long way. Terrific teamwork. Overtime still getting started here. Just about a minute in. Two minutes. Two. Here's Wheeler. And that one is stuck oh, right through. Oh, and he got yeah. fancy with that one. Yeah. It's extra time here. Just over a minute into overtime. Pass to Gilbert. And it's a defensive three-second violation. And the technical free throw is good. Really hurts. 
to take the lead. Yep, that one goes in there. 19 points in the game. Seconds off the clock here in the extra period. Up top right. Just five to shoot. It's rebounded by Hayes. And the activity he shows around the rim it is why he is such a respected defender. And you know what? He's not going to give up an easy finish at the rim. I mean, that's just a, against his constitution. Passes to Gilbert. The shot from 20 feet away. Bryant with the rebound. Guys, this possession could decide their fate. Yeah, they have to be careful with the ball. And, and he shows us all what the breakaway rim was invented for. Can you believe he almost brought the whole thing down by hanging on that long? Boy, that was a great dunk, and we've got a great game here. Pass to Portis. Bagley with the block. Six seconds separating the shot and game clocks. Wheeler. Good. And, and you know what? The defense allowed him to get into that rhythm. And that's a scary prospect, Greg. If he catches fire like that, he can single-handedly win a ball game. Denzel Here's Gilbert. No good on the quick three. And they commit an intentional foul. We'll see another one of those so they can get into the penalty. Game, I mean, plain and simple. Use every second you can on the clock here. And now they decide to foul intentionally. That's his third personal foul. At the line. Wheeler. Taking the first free throw is good, and that gives them a four-point cushion. Second one is good, getting both at the line, and it's a five-point game. Two-possession game now, guys. Some very important free throws there. From deep three-point range, doesn't go that time. And that was a little bit of a range check for him. You know, guys, I think he's got confidence to shoot it from anywhere, but he could have gotten a better one than that. At the line. Wheeler. Good on the first, and that increases their lead to six. So he gets them both, and it's a seven-point game. And guys, overtime not nearly as competitive as regulation. They've used up all their energy just getting it to overtime. And so they get the victory here at home. And they had some nervous moments down the stretch, but things finally came together for them in overtime. They yeah, probably didn't anticipate that this one would be that close down the wire, but give them credit. They were able to regroup in that overtime, and, and this win has to feel satisfying. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. So long.